wasn't at least one of our presidents involved in something like that? Future President Andrew Jackson kills a man who accused him of cheating on a horse race bet and then insulted his wife, Rachel. Within a few seconds, Dickinson fired, putting the first bullet into Jackson's chest next to his heart. Jackson put his hand over the wound to staunch the flow of blood. Despite smoke and dust billowing from Jackson's coat and his hand touching his chest, Jackson remained standing. Jackson fired, but the flint hammer stopped half cocked, not counting as a legitimate shot. Jackson aimed again ever so carefully and fired a second time. This time, the shot was good and the bullet hit Dickinson in the chest and he dropped to the ground. The doctor remarked to Jackson, I don't see how you stayed on your feet after that wound. To which Jackson responded, I would have stood up long enough to kill him if he had put a bullet in my brain.